hello guys welcome to our next video in this video we are going to talk about how to give a peer and uh, how to solve merge conflicts in git so let's start uh, if i goes into right now in my branch 2 so let me just show you so if you check the branch 2 got this cause as you remember from the last video um, let me just show you okay so the branch to get created from here right so that's why it's showing like this if I goes into my branch to let's say I changes something in here okay and save that and let me just comment that Comment um, to push that okay. So if it goes into my code, so branch 2 get pushed. If it goes into branch, branch 2 here. So if you check the branch to get this kind of changes and if you goes to the main branch it's get uh, these changes so let me just watch that branch yeah so if i compare and pull list i'm just gonna do so see uh, the branch to gonna merge into this from the server the git server I mean github create pull request so in the previous video I show you how to do that from local so in this video I'm gonna show you how to do this from the server so I just create the PR so it's get created and the file changes it's gonna make each this so that's how it's gonna change modify the file the main file so if i just give a march pull request confirm march so the branch get merged into the main main branch the branch 2 okay so i think there's no need for branch 2 because everything get merged into this so let me just delete that branch so I uh, deleted that branch also if I just goes into my uh, branch to if I try to pull this what will happen uh, the branch get deleted from server so see your configuration specific branch from remote but there's no such reference watch fixed because it's get deleted right so let me just Page that page. Uh, if I just goes into switch, if I see there's no remote uh, branch to only local here. So let me just switch it to the main branch. If I check that and if you check the server for main branch or uh, good the main text so see they are everything right so let me just switch it back to the branch 2 again branch 2 or wait uh, let me just create another branch let me create another branch I think that way you can understand it better create a branch branch 3 okay 
so I'm in branch 3 on the branch 3 is based on the main branch so if I go here let me just change something in here df so dfff save that I change that let me just comment that up dfff triple f okay so comment that up push so it's in the branch 3 right now I change that let me just switch back to the main branch switch to the main branch so there's no dff let me change here also df e this one so i just change that in the main branch let me save that so i change that in the main branch same line so let me just push that okay you need to pull that uh because i did not pull the last step so now uh, every time whatever happened in the uh, main branch actually what i did i merge the branch previously so there's two changes coming so that's why it's it's showing that uh, let me just push that from here you can just understand one minute okay so if you check that from the main branch purpose uh, see the commits so I added df he and merge the main of uh, repo 3 merge if you check the merge here so that was done by uh, the branch 2 right the previous branch please comment i think so that's coming and merge into the system so that's so if you remember uh, if you check the main branch right now in the main branch the this line the last second line is df uh, 4e and if i goes into my new branch branch 3 and check that it's d triple f right so two different thing here so let me just show you so this is the main branch let's say i committed uh, something here and i create a branch from here branch 3 so i committed something in here and something in here and in the same file uh, same line in the same line there so what will happen if i just try to do this merge this here so let me just show you what will happen here uh, let me just switch to the main branch i'm gonna merge i'm gonna merge branch 3 into my main branch try to merge that merge branch 3 into my main branch see so there's a conflict warning so if i click on ok and goes into so see automatic merge failed fix so the automation merge is not able to fix that so i need to fix that manually so it's showing as red so that means there's a conflict 
in the system uh, let me goes into that and uh, if I just show you so there say head uh, head uh, March it March it is the branch 3 so it's coming and the current branch that is head head is the main branch actually right now the current branch that is showing here so in the main branch i have this code and in the upcoming branch i have this code so here i need to decide which one i'm gonna take the yolo ones means it's uh coming so yolo ones are new line and the orange one are not there so orange one are previous so it's not gonna be the in the final version the orange one but the red one it can't able to decide which one it's gonna take so let's say i'm gonna take the uh, this one the head one so that's in the main branch so i'm gonna right click on that use this text to lock okay and say mark as resolve so it's coming here and let me just cross that cancel so let me just refresh that page and main so as i uh, fix the match conflict it's automatically created this uh, uh, message and i just need to comment that and let me just push that so what happened uh, the branch get merged into my system and i decide which one i need to take we just refresh that see merge it get merged but there is no changes because uh, i did not take the changes so that's how the march gonna happen let me show you another example let me just switch back to my uh, let me create another branch from the main branch create a branch which is branch 4 Uh, let me do the same thing okay so let me comment that and also. Uh, let me switch to the uh, my main branch and let me just comment something in here also let's say i'm gonna comment here something main commit let me just push that so let me just merge that new branch branch 4 so there's a conflict if you see the conflict right now um, there's conflict happen in the file so yes this line is this uh, this line is different here here uh, the branch 4 it can't able to conflict fix that let's say I want this line from here the main branch I want this but for here I want this one and for here I want this one so I can just choose that mark page resolve cross if I just try to comment that up right now 
it's gonna show okay there are some changes in the so these changes which it is uh, respect to the previous changes so that's why it's showing and previously in the uh, last march fix there's no changes showing no file changes here because there's no file changes actually i take all the main branch code so that's why it's not showing there so let me just comment that ignore and push that up so if i see that there's nothing changes the previous march but if i see the right now march branch 4 there's only one line of changes added in the main branch so that's it guys that's how we're gonna do the march thank you